please rise for a brief moment of silence followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, New Brighton. Today is Thursday, October 5th. Congratulations to Chloe Huddy, who is the winner of the School Spirit Photo Contest. Chloe receives $10 off of her 2024 yearbook. Per congratulations to Caden Bailey for being named the VOTAD Student of the Month in the Culinary Program and John Draybrick in the Auto Technology Program. If you are interested in participating in Trunk or Treat this year, please stop Mr. Tebe's room to sign up to and get additional information. There is a sophomore class meeting on October 16th during her room regarding classrooms. There's a senior class meeting on October 18th during homeroom regarding cap and gowns. Class rings, cap and gown orders are due on Thursday, October 23rd. This is the only in-school order day. You can order during all lunches at the table by the North Commons across from the elevators. Cap and gowns cost $30.74 including tax. Checks and money orders only accepted made to Drostons. Orders can be given to Miss Gentile in advance. Seniors, if you're interested in applying for the Lions Club Student of the Month, there is still time. Stop in the guidance office for an application. The completed applications are due back in the guidance by October 6th. Friday, October 6th, there is an Usher's Club meeting in the library during homeroom for anyone who signed up or who would like to join. Any senior interested in possibly attending CCBC after graduation is also welcome to attend the CCBC's Aim for the Future Friday field trip. You can pick up a permission slip in the guidance office. Completed permission slips are due back in the guidance office by October 10th. Absolutely no permission slips will be accepted after October 10th. Attention senior girls. Applications for the New Brighton Civics Women's Club Outstanding Senior Girl are now available in the guidance office. Completed applications must be turned into the guidance office and are due by the end of the day on October 3rd. Archer trials will take place on Saturday, October 7th and Saturday, October 21st from 3 p.m. to 7 p.m in the High School Central Gymnasium. Any student taking the SAT in October, this is a reminder that you must have a state ID, driver's license, or a school ID from this current school year. If you are in need of a school ID, please stop in the guidance office. Students, if you are driving to school, please make sure you have a parking permit. These are mandatory and can be purchased for $10 in the guidance office. Parking permit applications are also available in the guidance office. Any sophomore junior interested in a field trip to CCBC's in for the future Friday to learn more about the academics can pick up a permission slip in the guidance office. Completed permission slips are due back in the guidance office by October 10th. Absolutely no permission slips will be accepted after October 10th. The list below of colleges will be coming to our school to meet with you. Students in grade 9 to 12 are welcome to sign up. However, this visit counts for freshmen and sophomores for their career portfolio. If you are interested, you can sign up in the guidance office. Now on to sports. Come watch Cody, Caleb, and Kevin play in their first hockey game of the season tonight at Brady's Run Ice Rink at 645. First 50 students get a free whiteout t-shirt. And good luck to the volleyball team at their home game against Stowe Rocks tonight. Now on to weather. Weather for the day is cloudy with a 40% chance of precipitation, a high of 82, and a low of 62. Now back to the news. Lunch for today will be chicken gravy biscuit bowl, mashed potatoes, ham wrap, chicken sandwich, breaded chicken salad, and pizza. Menu subject to change. Have a great day, New Brighton.